Seniors, this message is for any of our students in the class of 2020 um, wanting to have some more information about eligibility for your high school diploma, graduation, and other information. Before I begin sharing information with you, I know this is an extremely difficult time and this is not the journey and plan you had to complete your time at Lewis Central. I'd ask that you keep in mind that if you think of 12 years, even though you had 13, as each year representing an inch and kind of thinking as your time here as a, a ruler of time, you've only missed roughly one quarter of an inch. And while it's been significant, you have so much to uh, look back upon and look forward based upon what you have already done. We know our district's mission is to inspire excellence, and you have no doubt done that for our school community and students within our district, whether it be your ACT scores, helping us achieve the fourth highest high school rating on the state profile, all of those of you recognized for the Hawkeye 10, all academic team, national merit scholars, and more. In addition to that, the achievements that you had in activities, competing on the state level in competitions, the championships that you've won, and the fine arts accomplishments that you have achieved, and likely could have achieved so much more had you been provided the opportunities. But as what has really stood out to me and is um, what saddens me that you didn't continue to finish out the way you would have hoped to have had is the fact that you've done it by supporting each other. You've done it through relationships and you've been able to persevere for unprecedented highs and lows of the accomplishments that I've already mentioned to the lowest of times of losing two of your dearest friends to this unprecedented time with COVID-19 and how it's impacted your schooling. But through that, you've supported each other and giving, given new meaning to what it means to be a community of excellence. Having said that, you probably have some questions about where do you stand with graduation and your high school diploma. So I wanna go through some of the quick information with you. In a nutshell, if you were on track to graduate, you will be awarded a diploma. As you can read on this display, it's based on your individual graduation plan. So any of the courses you would have needed for third trimester, you are going to not need those to meet your graduation requirement. As the last bullet talks, all of your um, third trimester courses will change to an NG, which represents no grade, with the exception of those of you enrolled in Iowa Western courses. We will waive those given the resolution the school board passed on Monday, and you will all graduate based on your graduation plan. Up here, you can see that I have an example. Even if you would have needed all six courses from your third trimester enrollment, you'll be awarded a diploma. Obviously, if you've already met the requirements, you're still on track for the diploma. And if you have any individual questions, please contact your school counselor. Some of the ways that you'll officially know that you've made it, and many of you probably already know if you have or haven't, is we'll be sending you some sort of notification, likely an email, something similar to those previous communications, whether or not you've been awarded a diploma for 2020 or not. In addition, on May 5th, we plan to deliver yard signs to all of the graduates from 2020. We'll communicate more specific information with you and let you know a window of time that we plan to deliver your sign in the event you would like to honor social distancing, but step out to your yard for a quick photo and so forth. Watch for more information over the next couple weeks. So what about some of your senior events? First of all, we are not canceling graduation, but rather rescheduling it at this point to Sunday, August 2nd, 2020. We will honor the same schedule we had planned for on May 24th. In addition to that, and on that adjacent Saturday, we will have the Senior Award Night, and preceding that on Friday the 31st, we will plan to have a rescheduled prom dance at the high school. 
please keep in mind these are all subject to whether or not there are continued restrictions for social distancing and the size of get gatherings. In the event we are unable to host the graduation on August 2nd, we will look for dates near our winter break, likely targeting December 20th, 2020. So what about some of the other things? Please be looking for information regarding the senior checkout process, returning items and gathering any items that you may have. You can also expect to see information from your individual clubs, classes and activities regarding checkout or returning items to school in the next several weeks. Seniors, I wanna thank you for all that you've done for our school, the achievements that you've accomplished, but more importantly, the manner in which you've done this. There is no doubt in my mind that the class of 2020 will re be remembered for many things. Not only the class that survived COVID-19, but more importantly, you will be the class that exemplified inspiring excellence through your accomplishments in your academics, activities, but most importantly, in the manner in which you handled not only the highs of your education, but the lows of the events of your senior year. Thanks so much and stay tuned for more information.